Hi guys and welcome back to my channel and um, tonight we've got an unboxing for you an unbagging of some diamond painting products and this is from the company called Paint Some Way and um, they have very kindly gifted me these products for review I have collaborated with them in the past before and um, they are budget friendly they have diamond paintings on their website they've got cross stitch um, oil paintings as well and they've always got special deals on I will link everything in the description box down below so do go check them out if you're after a few bargains or just some new projects to work on so yeah everything today will be linked individually down below so I think I've got four things to share with you today yes we do um, so we'll start with what we can see first of all here. I'm going to bring it down a little bit. I'll give you all prices in pound sterling, US dollars and euros. Um, and we'll have a look at everything and get a few measurements and things as well. I have got my tape measure, I've got my scissors. Excuse the glare from the ring light, but it's dark outside. So obviously I need a bit of extra light for my filming. So yeah, the first thing we have is this little sticker kit and let's have a little look here i'm just on the website now so it's called nine piece diy animal pineapple diamond painting stitches sorry stickers kit mosaic book decor um let's see inside i just thought it looked really fun and just really cheery and it's a really super quick project to do get the kids to do it or just yourself and just cheer yourself up <laughs> Um, so it's got everything in here that you need to be able to complete the project. So you have got a regular diamond painting kit with a large block of white, like double wax and some baggies. So that's actually really good. We have got our drills here, which I'll show you. Oh, they're just regular rounds. I thought they might be crystals or something, but they aren't. Um, oh, there might be a couple of specials in here. We'll have a look at those. And here are the stickers. I don't think I've had stickers before. Um, I've had like keychains and things, but I don't think I've had stickers. So these are just really cute. So life is better, like in flip flops. We've got pineapples, we've got soda cans, little turtle, starfish, a little seahorse, a flamingo, an octopus, and some very cute retro love heart sunglasses so these look really really sweet i think you're obviously going to peel this back for the sticky and then i think the actual stickers themselves are die cut oh and it's onto clear which is really good so yeah you can pop them on your maybe your laptop onto books just decorate whatever you want to decorate um let's look at the drills she says can i get in I can't get in these. Honestly, sometimes I just struggle to get in bags. There we go. Okay, okay. So it just looks such a summery project. And I know we're in autumn, probably going into winter now, aren't we? But um, yeah, I just thought it was something fun and happy and gorgeous. So we have got some amazing, a beautiful pink shade there gorgeous orange like a sort of beigey colour a more sort of pinky red fabulous green slightly deeper green a salmon pink a bit of a duck egg blue white black a dark turquoise a tangerine orange a grey then we've got some little crystal now what are these teardrops maybe is that what they're... and then some like yellow ones as well these are just pains in the back side to place <laughs> but that's okay so yeah we've got everything there let me tell you the prices of these just to pack the bills away and then they're packed away nice and safely twinkle twinkle and a couple of measurements actually. So like the sunglasses is so it's about seven and a half at its widest by maybe three. The soda can is about five and a half by three. The turtle is around about seven 
by three and a half. And then we'll just do the starfish, which is about six at its widest by around about five, thereabouts. So yeah, as well, it's just really, really cute. They do look fun. Just trying to see, I think that says chill on the um, can. I'm not sure how clear that'll turn out, but I'm pretty sure it says chill. Um, but even if it doesn't turn out very clear, it's just still very pretty. So yeah, I'm looking forward to doing that. It's just a little bit of fun, just a fun project. Um, and now I can't pack it away again. Honestly, sometimes it's just, <laughs> packaging can be a challenge. Okay, prices, let's see. So I hope you're all keeping well. The weather has definitely turned colder here in the UK. Although, to be fair, it's not freezing. Um, and it's still fairly mild compared to what we've had in recent years. Um, so price-wise for this, it is £2.60, $2.99, €2.99. So a nice, cheap little kit just to... Um, to pass a couple of hours, I dare say. Okay, next thing we have, let's do this one. Um, and I think I've got maybe like a full round, I think, of, of either this one or something very similar, but I decided to get the crystal version because I do love a little crystal. I'm waiting until there's um, like the smashing the specials sort of um, challenge again. I'm gonna whack loads of these out of my <laughs> the collection I've got so many specials and crystal art now in my inventory but yeah so what have we got we have got a regular a real a proper regular kit and um, just the pen the boat and the wax we have got our drills and they're all crystals and specials so we'll look at those in a minute and then how lovely is this so it's like a slightly crazy looking Highland cattle, Highland cow with a bow in her hair in a field of flowers. Is she not just adorable? Actually, this is not the same one as the one I've got. Um, I thought it was the same image. It isn't. It's totally different, but just beautiful. It's a 30 for 30 and um, the areas that aren't covered in drills do not have any glue. So it's a partial. I don't often get partial. So I get, tend to get more like full specials these days, but this will be really fast, really fun. And I love Highland cows. I've just ordered a load of like the Stephen Brown um, prints. I think they're just gorgeous. I can't wait to get them up in the lounge. So this is really beautiful. I love all the flowers. I think she's gonna look <laughs> great, but it's like the expression on her face is actually quite funny. She looks a bit confused. Um, <laughs> just fabulous so yeah 30 by 30 it is just under 25 by about 25 and then let's have a little look here at the drills that come with the kit so um we have got the canvas number on here which is yxc135 there are 11 different um gems i suppose you could say in here and oh look at that one to eleven how fabulous and it's got the crystal code at the side as well and on here we have got the yxc one three five so it does actually match up with the canvas so you can store the crystals separate to the canvas i put these in a portfolio just to keep them flat and then by the time i work on them they've come they're totally flat Let's see what we've got. These look really pretty. So we have got just some regular whites. And then some like, a bit like a, a brown. Then a bit of a lighter golden brown. Like a smoky grey. Red. And these are all different sizes. Oh no, they're not. They're all the same. My mistake. Reds. A beautiful pink. We've got like a smooth white pearl with AB coating. In medium yellow. A Monty in clear crystal. Is it clear? Yes, clear crystal. 
then in Monty in like a very sort of like pale yellow very pale and then this gorgeous gorgeous color here this sort of beautiful blue it is really pretty so yeah those are all of the drills i think it's just gonna be such a gorgeous little thing to work on i am looking forward to this a lot <coughs> excuse me whenever i talk I just, my throat gets really dry let's pack this away in here and then i'll give you the prices and what the name is on the website Check it out. let's have a look we have okay so it's called diamond painting partial special shaped flower yak um it's a 30 by 30 and the price is four pounds 35 which i think is such a bargain four dollars 99 four euros 99 but yeah is she not just gorgeous i think it's just gonna look absolutely fantastic and i think the flowers are gonna look really really pretty i'm um, very excited for this one okay the next one i'll do is this and i've been meaning to get this one for quite a while so i'm ever so pleased that i've actually finally picked it up um I just think it looks a really fun one. You maybe recognise it already just from this little bit here. Let me take this out. So we have got all of the drills. We have got a regular diamond painting kit. Let me just draw this back on itself. It's quite a stiff canvas. Okay, let's just show you it. How gorgeous is this? So it's a bunch of ladybirds, ladybugs if you're in the US. Um, sort of sunflowers and a gingham, maybe like tablecloth, I think. And some daisies in here as well. Is it not just gorgeous? So it's a 30 by 40. There is a canvas number NH1210. There are 24 colours. That is a DMC code. And it is all letters by the looks of it okay so it looks really clearly clearly printed doesn't it that is so clear yeah and there's a legend on the bottom right and on the upper left so yeah that is gorgeous let's do the measurements it comes I imagine it's 25 by 35 it is just under 25 by just under 35. Let's just flatten it out a bit. Oh, it's lovely and sticky. No issues with the glue. So it's a poured glue. I haven't had a um, double-sided tape yet. And I don't particularly want one actually. I'm quite happy with my pod glue canvases. So yeah, that's flattening out really easy already. And this, I think this is going to look really, really effective once it's done up. Um, really pretty. I hope someone does like a sunflower challenge next year because I've got so many sunflower diamond paintings. Yeah, the ladybirds, I think they're going to come out gorgeous on this. So let's have a quick look at the drills. So it is a round, a full round, first of 40. And we have got, we've got some browns, and these two different shades. We've got the rest of different shades there. Oh, that green is beautiful. Like a deep maroon. Brown, a lighter brown. Wow, that orange is fab. I think I've got quite a lot of this orange in my um, spare drills. This is what happens when you do a lot of sunflowers. <laughs> um, oh, that's a really nice colour. I don't think I've got that shade yet. Number 12, what's that? So that is 712. It's almost like an oyster. It's um, really nice. Fabulous green. I love green. Gorgeous red. Number 9 thought so that's 666 starting to recognize colors now from the dmc's which is good 
There we go. We'll get some grays. Darker gray. Deeper red. Black. Bright yellow. And then like a, it's like a, almost like an aubergine color. We've got a few here. Which is just, it's like an off-white. Forest green. And then like a corally red. I'm waiting for them to start doing this type of kit, you know, with some ABs in. And I think when they do that, that's going to be such a game changer. Um, it'd be really lovely, I think. And just like a little bit more like what you get with your more expensive kits. But how fabulous would it be to get it in a budget-friendly kit? Oh, I really wish you'd start including even just like one AB. Well, not one individual, maybe. <laughs> one colour <laughs> of ABs would be beautiful. Okay, so we have got the canvas number NH1210 on here. Yeah, so that marries up with that. So again, you can start this separately, which is a real big thing for me. Um, okay, let's see. We have got, it's called, so it's Diamond Painting Full Round Sunflower Ladybug 30 by 40. It costs £5.22 pence which is $5.99, which is €5.99. Euros 99. So again, ever so affordable. I mean, you just can't buy much these days for a fiver, can you? So yeah, if you get a few hours, well, it can even, depends how quickly you diamond paint. Like something like this, it'd take my mum about a month. She just sort of dips, sits, sits down, does like half an hour at a time. Although the other day she was finishing one off and she sat for three hours, which is a very long time for my mum to sit in diamond paint. And that's her complete two diamond paintings now. <coughs> actually no sorry she's completed three and she's absolutely loving it so i'm really pleased that she's enjoying this it's a great hobby all ages young and old and um, yeah so that's that so we've got one more to share and the last one i'm just starting to get a few more like this um this used to be very much my style when i made card make card making and this is a sort of stamp that i used to love to color so I'm really pleased that I've got some in diamond paintings. And here we go. Again, it's quite a stiff canvas. All of these canvases have been quite stiff in this haul. So to begin with, we have got a regular diamond painting kit. And then look at this. Hooray! Individual baggies. This is really a big thing, I think, that they're moving on to do this. Look at the colours, first off. How stunning. Look at this pink. Gorgeous greens, reds. Oh, there's some beautiful purples in there. I'm not taking these out. I'm very mean. <laughs> I should do, really, but I don't. Um, but, yeah, for me, I think the fact that they come in individual baggies is such a big thing because it means if you don't have storage for your drills it doesn't really matter you can just work from these individual bags um and there's no reason why you can't do that you can maybe just keep them together in a little box or like this i mean they're all numbered so yeah you can just work from the bags it's like no big deal it's absolutely fine and look at the kit i've got is she not beautiful really really gorgeous um just loving it so much Wow, the glue. It's, I've had a couple now where I think the, the, these um, sheets have been put on when it's just a little bit wet. It's super sticky. So maybe it's just because it's super sticky. But um, it's a little bit hard to peel back that paper, the film. Straightening out really. You can just feel there's like a little bit more resistance. I'm always worried I'm pulling the glue off. So I think she should turn up gorgeous. So there's like a butterfly in her hair. She's got gorgeous, gorgeous colourings. I hope that this isn't too lined. I hope it's like graduated quite nicely from the cheeks through to the flesh. And um, more butterflies, flowers, leaves. So pretty. So so pretty. Um size wise, so yeah, it's a 30 by 40. Ooh, 22 colours. Sorry guys. Legend upper left, bottom right. And we have got all letters. These are not printed the clearest, if I'm honest. I mean, it's not bad, but they're not terribly clear. Like the white ink on the darker colours is not the clearest. 
does have DMC numbers. The canvas, if you look here on the pale colours, really clear. As you get to the darker ones, I mean, it's not bad. I think you probably need good lighting. And once you're into the groove and you know what you're looking for, you're all right. The B's and the R's are similar-ish shapes. So be careful of that. And you never really know until you're diamond painting where there could be confusion and where there are similar looking symbols. But I mean, it looks reasonably clear, doesn't it? It looks pretty good. Have I measured it? I don't know, 30 by 40, let's double check. It'd be 25 by 35, won't it? So yeah, just under 25 by just under 35. And the price for this one is Excuse me, so it's called Diamond Painting Full Round April Fairy. It's £4.85, which is $5.56, €5.56. So let's just have a little recap of all the kits I got this time from Paints and Waves. We have got the April Fairy here, she's really pretty. We've got these gorgeous ladybirds with sunflowers, like loving that. They're really cute. They call it a yak. Looks a bit like a Highland cattle to me, but whatever. It's gorgeous. And then this really fun little sticker set here. And um, so yes, stickers are new to me, but I'm really happy to have that. And that is everything this month. So yeah, I really hope you've enjoyed this unboxing. Um, if you any of these kits have grabbed your attention and taken your fancy, as I said, the links are in the description box down below. So go and check them out. Thank you ever so much to Paint Somewhere for kindly gifting these to me. I um, can't wait to start them. I'm very, very thankful. And I'll see you all in my next video. Take care, guys. Stay safe. Mwah. Bye for now.